number 276. There are four balls of different colors. Two balls are taken at a time and arranged anyway. How many such combinations are possible? So given tayo ng four balls of different colors, tapos taken two at a time. At sabi niya, any arrangement daw. So ang required natin dito ay combinations. Kasi nga any arrangement, ibig sabihin yung arrangement niya hindi na importante. Otherwise, permutation ang hanapin natin. Pero dito combination. So yung solution nito, yung total number natin ay 4. Ito yung n natin. Tapos yung combination natin, taken 2 at a time. So 4C2. So I compute mo nandun sa calculator. So 4, shift. Tapos yung combination natin ay yung nasa divide. Ito. Tapos, 2. So, 4C2 ay 6. So, ang tamang sagot dito ay letter C. So, by the way, ang, ang formula ng combination natin ay parang permutation lang. Permutation, permutation of 4 taken 2 at a time divided by 2 factorial or yung R factorial. So, ang general formula nito Kapag ncr is equal to ntr divided by r factorial Which is also equal to So yung npr natin ay n factorial divided by n minus r factorial Multiply mo lang yan ng r factorial Kasi nga dinidisregard mo na yung arrangement ng mga elements na kukunin mo so, itong, itong R, ito yung number of elements na kunin mo. For example, dito, meron tayong dalawang kinukuha. Ngayon, since hindi na importante yung arrangement nila, i-disregard natin. So, i-divide natin yung permutation natin ng R factorial. Kaya magiging combination na lang siya. So, ito yung formula ng combination natin. Number 277. How many six number combinations can be generated from the numbers from 1 to 42 inclusive? Without repetition and with no regards to the order of the numbers. Six number combinations from 1 to 42 in any order. So, hanapin natin dito as stated combinations. Kasi any order daw. So, parang sa loto. So, ilan yung possible na six number combinations from 1 to 42? So, meron tayong total of 42 numbers. Tapos, kukunin natin yung total number of combinations taken six at a time. So, ganun lang kasimple. So, 42, shift, yung divide sign, tapos 6. 5,245,786. So, letter B ang tamang sagot dito. So, ito yung possible number of combinations kapag tataya ka sa loto. Number 278. Find the total number of combinations of 3 letters. JRT taken 1, 2, 3 at a time So given tayo ng 3 letters hahanapin natin kung ilan yung possible combinations taken 1, 2, 3 at a time So combinations stated mismo sa problem <coughs> So para malaman natin yan isa-isayin natin pwedeng isa-isayin natin So yung total number of combinations is equal to since meron tayong 3 Combination of 3 taken 1 at a time plus combination of 3 taken 2 at a time plus combination of 3 taken 3 at a time. So, pag sinold mo to, 3 combination of 1 plus 3 combination 2 plus 3 combination 3. So, meron tayong 7. So, ang tamang sagot dito ay letter A. Pero meron tayong shortcut dito para mas mabilis kang mag-solve. Kapag ganito yung problem, given ka ng certain number of elements, tapos, i-combination mo sila from 1 up to N. So, from 1 to 3. So, take 1, 2, at 3 at a time. For example naman, 5 to, 5 elements to, take 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 at a time. Paano kapag yung given natin, 100 elements? Tapos sabi niya, Find the total number of combinations taken 1 to 100 at a time. So, mahirap isolve yun. Kasi masyadong mahaba kapag isa-isayin mo. 
So, meron tayong shortcut. So, applicable lang ito sa combination. Hindi pwede sa permutation. So, tatandaan nyo yan. So, yung total number of combinations is equal to 2 raised to n minus 1. So, ganun lang kasimple. Kung ilan yung total number of elements, yun yung n natin. So, 2 raised to n minus 1. So, dun sa problem natin, meron tayong 3. So, yung total number of combinations natin, 2 raised to 3 minus 1 lang. So, 2 raised to 3 ay 8 minus 1, 7. So, ganun lang kasimple. So, tatandaan nyo yun. Number 279. In how many ways can you invite one or more of your five friends in a party? So, ito yung given natin. Meron kang limang friends, tapos mag invite ka one or more. Ibig sabihin, pwedeng one, pwedeng two, pwedeng three, four, at five. So, parang yung previous problem natin kanina. Number of combinations na hinahanap natin. Tapos, taken one, two, three, up to n at a time. So, pwede natin gamitin dito yung shortcut. So, di ba yung shortcut natin kanina, c is equal to 2 raised to n minus 1. So, dito, equal to sa 2 raised to 5 yung total number of elements natin, minus 1. So, 2 raised to 5 ay 32, minus 1, 31. So, ang tamang sagot dito ay letter B. So, pwede mong itry. Pwede mong itry yung conventional solution natin. Pwede mong isa-isahin. Pwede mong i-5 combination 1 plus 5 combination 2 plus 5 combination 3 plus 5 combination 4 plus 5 combination 5. The same din lang makukuha mo. Equal din to sa 31. Number 280. In how many ways can a committee of 3 consisting of 2 chemical engineers and 1 mechanical engineer can be formed from 4 chemical engineers? and 3 mechanical engineers. So, meron tayong 4CHE tsaka 3ME. So, from them, kukuha tayo ng committee of 3. So, dalawang CHE daw tsaka 1ME. So, ang required natin, number of possible combinations. So, simple lang solution nito. So, dun sa una, so, yung total number of combinations natin is equal to so, from 4CHE, kukuha tayo ng dalawa. So, from 4 kukuha tayo ng combination ng dalawa. Tapos, i-multiply natin ng from 3, 3 M is kukuha tayo ng isa. So, ganyan lang kasimple. 4 combination 2 times 3 combination 1. So, 4 combination 2 times 3 combination 1. So, 18 ang tamang sagot dito. So, letter A ang tamang sagot. Number 281. In mathematics examination, a student may select 7 problems from a set of 10 problems. In how many ways can he make his choice? So, from 10 problems, pipili daw tayo ng 7. So, ang required natin dito ay number of combinations. Kasi hindi naman importante yung arrangement ng problem. Basta pipili lang tayo ng 7 problems from 10. So, ang solution nito, simply, Yung combination is equal to combination of 10 taken 7 at a time. So, 10, shift, and divide sign, 7. So, ang tamang sagot ay 120, which is letter A. Number 282. How many committees can be formed by choosing 4 men from an organization of a membership of 15 men. So from 15 men, kukuha tayo ng 4 men to form a committee. So hinahanap natin dito ay number of combinations since committee lang siya. So ang solution natin dito, C is equal to 15 combination 4. 15 shift divide 4. So 1365. 1365. So, dun sa choices, letter D ang tamang sagot. Number 283. A semiconductor company will hire 7 men and 4 women 
In how many ways can the company choose from nine men and six women who qualified for the position? So given tayo, meron tayo nine men and six women. And from them, kukuha tayo ng seven men and four women. Since walang sinabing positions or roles na ibibigay sa kanila, i-assume natin na pare-parehas yung roles nila. So dahil dyan, combinations ang hinahanap natin. Hindi permutation kasi wala silang specific na position. So kukuha lang tayo ng 7 from 9 tapos 4 from 6. So ang total number of combinations natin is equal to uh, unahin natin yung men. So from 9, kukuha tayo ng 7 times from 6, kukuha tayo ng 4. So 9 combination 7 times 6 combination 4. So, 540. So, ang tamang sagot dito ay letter B. 540. Number 284. There are 13 teams in a tournament. Each team is to play with each other only once. What is the minimum number of days can they all play without any team playing more than one game in any day? So, given tayo ng 13 teams, tapos 2 teams play each other. So, 2 teams play each other. Tapos, 1 game per day per team. So, ibig sabihin, ang isang team, hindi pwede mag maglaro ng dalawang beses. Dapat, once a day lang. Yun ang maximum. So, ang required natin dito ay number of combinations. Or, actually, number of days. Number of days ang hinahanap natin dito. Hindi number of combinations. Actually, itong problem na to, very straightforward. Malalaman mo yung sagot without solving. So, kasi, for example... Uh, nasa isang team ka tapos 13 kayong lahat so sa isang araw isang beses ka lang pwede maglaro tapos kailangan mo silang makalaro lahat so ikaw yung isa dun so kailangan mo makalaro yung 12 12 other teams so ilang beses ka maglalaro 12 times so yung 12 times na yun 12 days kaya lang hindi even yung number ng teams ibig sabihin Every time na mag-match up tong mga to, merong isang matitira na walang kalaban. Bawat team merong isang araw na walang kalaban. So for example, yung team mo, isang araw wala kayong kalaban. So mag add ka lang ng plus 1 day dito, kung saan, buy kayo. So ang tamang sagot dito ay 13. 13 days. Which is letter C. Ngayon naman, isold natin yan gamit ng combinations. So yung 13 teams, I-divide mo sa dalawa para mag-match up sa isang araw. So, pag dinivide mo yan, meron tayong 6 matches. 6 matches per day. Tapos, yung remainder natin na isa, buy yung team na yun. Wala silang kalaban. So, meron tayong 6 matches per day. Ngayon, alamin natin kung ilan yung possible combinations dun sa 13 teams na yun. So, i-combination natin. Total number of combinations is combination of 13 taken 2 at a time. So, 13 combination 2. Meron tayong 78. So, 78 total matches to. Yung combination, ito yung matches. Total number of matches. So, since meron tayong 6, six matches per day, I-divide natin 78 matches divided by 6 matches per day. So, makakansal yung matches tapos day ang matitira. Yun yung magiging unit ng answer natin. So, 78 divided by 6 meron tayong 13 days para makompleto lahat yung matches na yun. 13 days which is similar doon sa sagot natin so yun pala ang tamang sagot letter C, 13 number 285 there are 5 main roads between the cities A and B and 4 between B and C in how many ways can a person drive from A to C and return going through B on both trips without driving on the same road twice so, given tayo ng 3 points, point A, point B, at point C. 
So between A and B, meron tayong 5 roads. Between B and C, meron tayong 4 roads. Tapos ang required natin dito, number of ways or number of permutation. So bakit permutation? Kasi importante yung arrangement dito. So for example, yung pagta-travel mo ng A at B, pagpunta mo ng A at B, meron kang 5 roads, 5 different roads. So road 1, road 2, road 3, road 4 at road 5. So, dun sa 5 roads na yun, pipili ka ng dalawa. Kasi dadaanan mo yung dalawang yun. So, for example, pinili mo yung road 1 at road 2. So, tingin mo ba importante yung arrangement niya? So, importante yung arrangement dito. Kasi yung isang road, dadaanan mo papunta. Yung isang road naman, dadaanan mo pabalik. So, for example, ito. Ang pa isang possibility, yung road na papunta, dun ka sa road 1. At pabalik doon ka sa road 2. Pero another possibility naman, papunta doon ka sa road 2 at pabalik doon ka sa road 1. So magkaiba yung dalawang yun. Kahit pareha sila na combination, 1 and 2, dalawa yung possibilities, dalawa yung permutation nila. Kaya permutation ang hinahanap natin dito. So isolve natin yung problem na yun. So ang total permutation, between A and B, kukuha ka ng dalawang roads. So, from 5 permutation, kukuha ka ng dalawa. Times, between 4 roads, kukuha ka ng dalawang roads. So, ganun lang kasimple. Five permutation of 2. Times, 4 permutation of 2. So, 240 ang tamang sagot dito which is letter B. So, another solution. For example, magde-decide ka from A to B to C. Tsaka pabalik. So, from C to B to A. So, from A to B, ilan yung choices mo na roads? Meron kang limang roads, di ba? So, meron kang limang choices. Tapos, from B to C, ilan yung choices mo? Meron kang 4 roads. So, 4. Ngayon, pagbalik mo, ilan na lang yung choices mo? Between B and C, ilan yung choices mo? 3 na lang, kasi nga nadaanan mo na yung isa. Hindi mo pwedeng daanan yung isang road ng dalawang beses. So, 3 na lang yung choices mo dito. The same din dito sa A and B. Ilan na lang yung choices mo? Apat na lang, mababawasan ang isa yung 5. Kasi nga nadaanan mo na yung isa kanina. So, ganyan lang kasimple. I-multiply mo lang itong mga to. 5 times 4 times 3 times 4. So, 5 times 4, 20. Times 3, 60. Times 4, 240. The same din lang. 240 din lang yung sagot dito.